Why choose Colchester for your next big machining purchase? Find out this Wednesday on Sports and Chips in the July Heatwave Special. And normally this is, I, don't, I know it sounds like a really stupid thing, but sometimes I forget the M codes for kind of the machine builder specific well, M codes. Well, if you Google them, sometimes they're not right. So having it on the machine makes life so much easier. Yeah, exactly. You don't want to press, do the wrong M code and say like rotary table on clamp and then it will spin around. No, and... it's definitely not. I feel like working on a CNC machine, it kind of abstracts you away from the real intricacies of how the system actually oh, works. Oh, to me Whereas... that looks daunting. Yeah, it, well, because it does. I mean, what, you look at the big tables. Yeah, exactly. You look at the big tables and you've got uh, CR1W will tell you how to do a 0.2 uh, milpa rev, um, milpa rev uh, threaded in pitch, which is like, which sounds quite complicated, but you just got to basically move these gears, take the clutch off, move these gears, and then um, you get that, that thread pitch, which, again, like you say, is quite daunting, but I think it's quite nice for students to understand how this is how the, the, the machine will electronically actuate these gears, rather than you doing um, the gears your, yourself. You don't have to set the CNC up. You don't have to change your jaws. Quick, little scroll chuck, and you're away. Exactly. No, no tool sets, no work offsets, no programming in Fanoc or Siemens, or you have to worry about any of that. You just bang your part in, clock it up, uh, set your roughing, your, um, your little roughing tool, and then you can start winding the handles and making parts straight away.